What is up guys, it's Fatty Cyclops here and I'm just doing episode 2 of the Getting Started tutorials uh, and today I thought I'd talk to you a little bit about weapons um, in order to, to survive in uh, Minecraft you're going to need weaponry of some sort and there's several different types um, obviously the easiest weapon to get is swords um, and all you need for those are wood planks again you can get those from the, the trees that you chop down make some planks into sticks and then one stick and two wooden planks will make your wooden sword um, make a stone sword up as well it's just one stick and two uh, stone or cobblestone blocks obviously a diamond sword is going to be preferable because that will give you the sort of the, the highest rate of damage against the mobs um, so yeah swords are a good option arrows uh, bows and arrows are very easy um, arrows you can pick up from skeletons once you've killed them so you can start off using uh, using a sword and then once you've killed a few skeletons and you've got some um, got some arrows then obviously get a bow made up and you've got yourself a weapon if you can enchant the bow again then yep that will make you uh, make you a bit harder to defeat so all you need for a bow is three sticks and some spiders web or string that you catch from um, that you get even not catch from uh, from spiders so we'll have a little wander around and see what we can find we've got our stone sword now so um, as you can see it's uh, if you can catch your things couple of hits and you've got your uh, your friendly mob killed obviously a spider or skeleton or something like that takes a little bit more beating before it dies before you can steal its goodies but you'll see what I mean um, just a quick tip as well when you're mining um, if you're looking at ways of uh, lighting the place up you can make a um, a very quick furnace and make some torches up just quickly show you how to do that so you get your furnace that's just simply your furnace is eight blocks of cobblestone to make up and what you can do is you pop your furnace down and if you put in there spruce wood actually let's take half of this um, I don't know whether it's spruce wood or no it's not, it's the actual wood itself. So what we need to do is find a handy tree. There's one. And I'll just quickly show you how to make some torches. And this will uh, hopefully take us through to night time and we can go and find some mobs to kill. There we go. Just take the last of this. that and just quickly show you right so you basically use the uh, the planks to burn the wood and that will create lumps of charcoal so when you've got your charcoal you just go into your weapon selection and you make torches so one bit of wood and one bit of charcoal makes four torches and this is handy when you're mining obviously just so you can see where you're going see what's about and there you go I don't have my pickaxe with me right now so we'll see if we can quickly find some uh, see if we can find some iron while we're waiting for night time to come well, I don't think night time is going to be very long so we just put that there like that that'll stop any mobs getting in and surprising us while we're digging away because we don't want that to happen let's see what we can find quickly it's typical when you're doing a when you're recording and nothing comes right okay it's night time outside so let's go and find some mobs make sure we've got some yeah we've got some sticks We'll make some sticks up. Four sticks, that'll do. Where's my sword? Here it is. Right, let's find some spiders. Alright, oh, heard one. There's one. There we go. Right, okay. 
There we go, and we've got one piece of string. I think we need three to make a bow, so we'll just sort of hang about here for a bit and see if another spider comes along. The zombie's gone for a swim. Ah, there's a skeleton. Is that a skeleton over there as well? There's a skeleton over there. So what we'll do... We'll go and get an arrow. So we'll meet the zombie. He'll come and see us. Come on. Let's just keep an eye on that skeleton a minute. Try not to lose any health. Have a couple of wax. Just making sure he keeps his distance so he doesn't have full health when I go and fight that skeleton. There you go, that's him gone. Right, here's the skeleton. Dodgy arrows. And beat him. What do we get then? Any arrows? <laughs> no, just bones. Brilliant. <laughs> So they, they drop bones as well, which are obviously useful for tailing dogs, but um, yeah, it's the arrows we bought at this time and we, <laughs> we typically didn't get any. Fantastic. Um, there's another spider up there, so we just wander over to him. Can we collect that? No. We sort of hang about down here, that spider should... Ah, there's another one. Whoa, he jumped on my head. Oh, Rubbish. But you can see there, you can see that we got enough string to make a bow, uh, as well as being blown up by a creeper. Brilliant! Didn't even see him coming. Oh, I hate creepers! I hate creepers! Right, let's go and quickly uh, go and quickly craft this bow before we get jumped on by something else. There we go. One bow. Brilliant. Right, what do we need? We need a skeleton. I'm just gonna get his XP. Come on skeletons, where are you? Don't want to go too far because I'll end up getting lo lost. Is that a skeleton over there? No, it's a vine. That is a zombie. Come on, skeletons, where are you? Come on. Oh, spider. Come on, skeletons. Perhaps it's too cold for them. They ain't got much fat on them, have they, skeletons? So it's a bit snowy around here. We got four oh, creeper, not going that way. Ooh, zombie. Ah, another zombie. Oh dear. There's another zombie. What's with all the zombies? Where are all the skeletons? Ah, there's one. Right, okay, brilliant. We'll just take a wander over here. That is a doggy. Right, dogs are very easy to tame. You just basically get a bone that you get up, pick up from the um, skeleton, and then you just select the bone. And then you... Ah, damn it. Select the bone, tame the dog, tame the dog, uh, and he didn't like it. Sometimes they take a few bones to tame, and I'm going to die in a minute. I can hear a skeleton whacking me as well. Let's have a go around here. Ow. Wow, there's a creeper as well, fantastic. Come on, just gonna give myself some time to get away and get some health back. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, sometimes the wolves or dogs or whatever they are, they take a few bones. Now, Alton took two and still wasn't up for it. So you have to... Uh, need some life back desperately. Keeper. Yeah, sometimes they don't have a bar of it and you have to kill... You have to give them several bones before they become tame. But they're useful to have, you know. When As soon as you've got one, they are very useful. You can have a pack of the things as well. And they'll help fight the mobs protect you. I'll just hang around here for a bit while my uh, my health regenerates. And then I'm gonna go back in for that um, go back in for that skeleton. There's a zombie there. Is that a zombie? Yeah there's a zombie. Here he comes. Keep that one Right, yay, now we've got arrows. So, basically, arrows. You select your bow, and arm yourself, and we've got one shot. We've got one shot. So it's going to play work. Didn't you see him? There we go. There we go. It's as simple as that. And <laughs> not that that did anything. Um, but it just damaged him slightly to enable us to kill him. But obviously, the more skeletons you kill, the more arrows you're going to get. Find some chickens. When you kill the chickens, oh, there's another skeleton. When you kill the chickens, they'll drop feathers. Get some uh, flint as well, and that'll help you. Oh, there's some more arrows there for you. Dies. This dude as well. Ow! Oh, lucky. Swim away because there's a spider. Oh, what's that? How close is he to me? Oh, he's very close. <laughs> and he's getting daylight as well, so there we go. I'm dying. I'm just going to run away now so I don't actually die. Not sure where the spy spider doesn't get on too well on ice by the looks of things. So there we go. We got four um, four arrows, and they're quite effective. Moving target. Uh, he stopped. There we go. Two arrows to kill a mob for some XP. Fantastic. I'm not hardly going to go into the Olympics for archery, but never mind. That gives you a general idea of weaponry. Um, yeah, diamond up as soon as you can, because that'll help you. Um, yeah, and there we go. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, very basic, getting started weaponry uh, in Minecraft for the Xbox 360. Obviously, get your enchanting table as soon as you can. And that will help upgrade your weapons and help you kill the mobs faster so thanks very much for watching guys don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel There'll be more uh, basics getting started type tutorials coming soon and there's the let's play or the play it series not let's play sorry rooster teeth um, and some tutorials coming up as well so i look forward to seeing you on the next video thanks very much for watching